Have you ever wondered how some designers create those amazing posters that look like they take days to create? Well, what if I told you that you can create the same posters in minutes using the help of AI? In this video, I'm going to show you my step-by-step -step that will take you for a complete beginner to creating designs that look like they were made by a professional. Before we start, let me show you something incredible. It was created entirely using AI in less than 10 minutes. And today I'm going to show you exactly how to create this even if you never designed anything before. So we're going to go over how to generate unique design ideas with AI, the exact professional tools that you can use to create your AI posters, and the secret technique to make your designings stand out. And we're not only going to Pinterest and trying to find some inspiration from it. Let me show you a more effective approach. First of all, I'm going to open my hands. And over here, I'm just going to go and look for poster. But here is where most people go wrong. They just save some random designs that they like. But instead, what I would recommend you to do is analyze the composition of the posters, the combinations that work well, the typography arrangements, the balance between the elements, and you could even take a look of how they use the space on each of these posters. There are two types of designers. Those that jump straight into the designing and end up with generic designs. And then those that understand the principles of creating a design. So over here, I can take a look of what is working well on these kind of posters. As you can see over here, we can see some different options for creating our poster. Over here, we can see the combination of a lot of fonts works well. And I will go and then just start to look for something similar to what I want to create. So over here, I can just go and open this. And then I want to do something like this so i can just go and then understand that yellow with black will stand out better because their contrast is more strong so i'm just gonna go keep looking and keep understanding the principles of each design and from here just grabbing some ideas that i can use later on for my own so once I already took enough inspiration, I can jump in into the creation of my own poster. And for this, I'm going to be opening my Keto account. If you don't have an account yet, you can click the link in my description and you can create one completely for free. Once we are in the Keto homepage, over here, I'm just going to click in create new project. As you can see over here, we can go and select the specific sizing for our design because I'm going to be creating a poster. I can go and just directly select that option. But in case that you want specific measurements for your own poster, you can go and then adjust the sizing over here. You can even change it to these measurements. So I already click in poster and I can click in create. So once I open my design of Keto, we can see it over here and I can start with the designing of this because I'm going to be using AI tools with the designing of our poster. So first of all, I'm going to be starting with the AI tool and then later on I can go and then start to adjust it based on the principles that I mentioned earlier. So first of all, I'm going to go to the section of Keto AI and over here, I'm just going to click in design generator. On this section, you can see that we have many options. We have, I want to create a, and then we have a logo, a t-shirt, a poster, sticker, social post, and even advertiser. So over here, I'm just going to go and select the option of poster. Once I already select this option, I can go and then just specify with a prompt for what I want to create my poster. So I'm going to be making it for a yoga studio. So I can go and then just paste it over here. I would recommend you that you keep it in simple words so it's easy for the AI to create your poster. Over here, we're going to go to the section of color. You can go and then select colors from here. Or if you don't want to use the options of colors that they give you over here, you can go and describe your color palette. So I think I'm going to be using purple and blue. You can even choose two colors. So I can go and make purple and pink. I like something like that. And over here, we can go and select the style for our poster. So I think I'm going to make it. I think that will really grab attention. So I can go and click in generate. Now it's going to take a few seconds till it generate our poster. 
So over here, now it generates some options for us. And I think I like it. I could keep some of these options and try them. As you can see, I really like this one. What I'm gonna do is just go and add it over here. So as you can see, it added in this section, but it didn't add it into my poster. So we can go and then just take this as a guide, or if you only like it, the fonts, you can go and then just grab the fonts. I really like it, the image that created here, but I think I also wanna check some other options. I think this one, I really like it too. So we have it here, it's a good option, we can change some colors, we can really work with this. So I think I'm gonna also add it over here. This one also I really like, so I think I'm also gonna add it. We're just gonna go and then just get some inspiration as well. So I think I'm gonna go grab it and then over here I'm just gonna put it over here. Just based on what we saw before that we already knew that we want, you can go and just grab different elements from all the creations that you can get from Kittle. So I'm gonna go and I'm gonna click in generate again so I can see if I get something better. All right, so I think I got this one as well. This one is also nice. It's like I really like the typography over here and I think I really could work with something like this. I'm just gonna go grab it and then just place it next to my other inspirations. And I think I already know what I'm gonna be creating out of this. Now, if you wanna change something like maybe the style, the colors, or anything that you didn't mention before, you can go and click and go back. And over here you can go, and then over here you can go and change the style maybe to retro or to cute or a different style that you would like to try. So now that I have these posters, what you could do very easily is let's say that I only like it this one you can just go grab all the elements that you like it and then just place it over here and then you can just adjust them pull it and adjust till you like it I think something like this work very well and then we can even adjust only these letters by selecting everything and then just adjust it over here and now the only thing that i'm not really comfortable with about this one is this uh symbol i think it's not my favorite so what you could also do with Kito copilot by clicking in this symbol you can go and then change this image so let's say i don't really like it this one so i'm just gonna go and then just type yoga so we can get an element from here that we can use in our poster and then here we go we get this element that we saw before we can get something else and on here you can even go and generate your unique graphic with ai as well so i'm just gonna go i'm gonna click in generate it with ai and over here is gonna send us to the image generation inside of Kito. and then over here i'm gonna go and add my prompt like any other ai now i already have my prompt what you could also do over here is just go and choose your style. So let's say that I really want a retro picture because I think that it really fits with the typography that I add over here. So I can go and then I add retro photo. And over here, something that I really like about Kito is that you can go and add your own style. So let's say that I want a certain style for my poster. I can go upload it in this section and then just add it into my poster. And now I can click in generate image and as you can see it already generate my image so over here i have the women that it's making yoga this is not exactly an element that i can just go and add into my poster but what i can do is just go and click in remove background and inside of Kito, you can go and then just create your element from the image that we just created so it's very simple and over here we also get images inside of this same style so i actually like it more this one which is also very good and i'm gonna make the same i'm gonna go and click in remove background but to be honest i think i like it more with the background on it so what i'm gonna do is just go and send my image all the way to the back so i don't miss all my elements so i think i'm gonna be adding this one you can go and then keep adjusting your image so i think i would like it more like this so you can get in the middle and then over here it's applying your designing skills with the help of ai so we can start to work with this one so i can go and then just place it over here and then i'm gonna make exactly the same i'm gonna click in this three dots i'm gonna send it to the back and then over here we have this 
this part and this and then over here some information that I can add in my class so this one over here I really like it this typography but I don't really feel like the combination of colors here make my fonts to stand out so I'm just gonna go and change the colors so because we have orange already in the picture I will make it some other color that stand out better so maybe we can try it out with white so there and yeah it's standing out better so I can go change the color of all the fonts of my poster so what you could also do is just go and make combinations of the elements that you got from the posters so I think I really like this one but we can put it over here like higher and then I can go and then just add this section over here I think these fonts are a very good match to the poster that I'm creating over here so I'm just gonna go, I'm gonna select these two elements. You can go and then just grab them one by one, but I'm gonna get all of it and then I'm just gonna place it over here and then just start to see how it mixed together. Mm, I don't think I like it a lot. So now I already put all the fonts that I wanted into my poster. But let's say that I don't really like any of these fonts that the AI generated for me. I can go double click and then over here you can go and change the font of your poster. So over here you can go and add it, you can go and change it, you can grab something from here and then just keep customizing your poster. And now that I like the end result of my poster, I can go select all of these and then I can delete it so I don't stay with anything else than my own poster which looks really amazing I really like this end result you can start using Kito completely for free but you will only get 20 credits for your AI creations otherwise you can sign up for a paid plan for the pro version if you decide to pay yearly you will only have to pay $10 per month and you will get 200 AI creations per month and for the expert plan if you decide to pay yearly you will only have to pay $24 per month and you will get 600 AI creations. If you use my discount code you will get 25% discount on your first month or even on your first year. So don't miss the chance to create amazing posters using the help of Keto AI. Now you have learned how you can create amazing posters using the help of AI. And you're probably wondering what else you can do with the help of AI. If you want to learn how to create t-shirt designs using AI, you can watch the video, link on my description. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you for watching and see you in another video. Have a great day.